Welcome to Gang of Four Online, Days of Wonders computer adaptation of the coolest card game to come out of Asia in decades. This short animation will explain all you need to know to play the game in eight minutes flat. A simple yet addictive trick-taking card game, Gang of Four is played with a deck of 64 cards. 60 cards are numbered from 1 to 10 and come in three colors, green, yellow and red, with precisely two copies of each card in the deck. The remaining four cards are unique, special cards. They are a multicolored one, the strongest of all ones, a green and yellow phoenix that when played together form the strongest pair of the game, and a red dragon, the strongest single card of the game. At the start of each hand, the players receive 16 cards. Your goal is to be the first to get rid of them all to avoid taking penalty points for any cards remaining at the end of each hand. This is done by playing a combination of cards similar to those that exist in poker. For example, a single, pair, three of a kind, four of a kind, or one of the various five card combinations on top of the cards already on the table. As soon as one player has no cards left, the hand is finished and the points are scored based on the number of cards in the remaining player's hands. A new hand is dealt and the cycle repeats until one or more of the players reaches at least 100 points. At this time, the game ends. The player with the lowest total number of points is then declared the winner. Now let's see how you can play cards from your hand to get rid of them. On the first hand, the player with the multicolored one always starts the game. His first play must be a combination of one to five cards that includes the multicolored one, such as a pair of ones or a straight including this one. Each player then in turn plays a combination of cards made up of the same number of cards as the opening combination, but in a higher rank or they can pass. Select the cards you wish to play by clicking on them. Double click on a card to automatically select all the cards with the same numerical value. Click on play or hit enter on your keyboard to play the cards you selected. The combination you play must contain precisely the same number of cards as the combination already on the table, but with a higher rank. If a five-card combination was played, you may only play a stronger five-card combination on top. One exception. The gang of four, or four of a kind, is wild and can always be played on top of any other combination, regardless of the number of cards currently in play. The same holds true for larger gangs, like gangs of five, six, or seven. To pass, click the Pass button or hit Space on your keyboard. Remember that playing is always optional. You can choose to pass even if you have cards you could play on top of the current combination on the table. Sometimes it is preferable to pass to keep valuable cards in reserve for later. The cycle continues until all players have passed. The last player to have played then opens a new cycle by playing a combination of cards of his choice. The process repeats itself until a player lays down his last card. Points are scored and a new hand is dealt to all players. Unlike in other games, the direction of the play will alternate back and forth between clockwise and counterclockwise each time a new hand is dealt. One more thing, the loser of the previous hand automatically loses his best card to the winner of the previous hand, who gives him back a card of his choice in exchange. Usually not a great one. The cards thus exchanged are visible by all. In Gang of Four, the strong get stronger and the weak get weaker. The combination of cards played in Gang of Four are similar to those found in poker. The color of the cards and their numerical value determine how they rank within a given category. Green is weaker than yellow, which is weaker than red. So a green one is weaker than a red one. 
which in turn is weaker than the special, multicolored one. The higher the numerical value, the stronger the card. So a green 6 beats a red 5. In pairs, the strongest card of each pair is compared first, then the next. So a yellow and red 2 beats a green and red 2. Likewise for threes of a kind. Also, five card combinations are ranked from weakest to strongest. Straight, flush, full house, straight flush, that can be played on top of each other. Straights are a combination of five cards in numerical sequence. Flushes are combinations of five cards of the same color. A full house is a combination of a pair and a three of a kind. And straight flushes are combinations of five cards of the same color in numerical sequence. Remember that four of a kind and the even more elusive five, six, or seven of a kind are considered as wilds and can always be played on top of the standard combinations, regardless of the number of cards these contain. If you are ever unsure of what to play next, click on the Auto button repeatedly to cycle through the set of all the combinations you are allowed to play. The combinations suggested are presented in order of increasing strength, as it is often desirable to get rid of your weakest cards first. To cycle through the possible combinations in reverse order, hold the Option key down while clicking on Auto. If the Auto button is disabled, there are no cards you can play on top of the combination currently on the table. In this case, you must pass. This concludes our brief introduction to Gang of Four. Now go out and play! Your first game will be against three friendly robots, giving you a chance to experiment on your own. Further games will be against robots or live opponents. It'll be your choice!